Hello, and welcome to 5-Minute Math. Today we are looking at the third grade concept of compare and order numbers. This is standard 3.2D in the great state of Texas, and we are using item number 13 of the 2023 released STAR test. If you haven't done so already, please go ahead and take a moment to pause the video, work this problem out on your own, unpause it, and we will look at our answers together. So we've got four different lists of numbers. Each list has got three numbers. And it looks like we need to find numbers that belong between, and we see these two numbers here. It's 5,090 and 6,300. So we could draw a number line, uh, but that's going to be a little bit strange. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to kind of draw like a vertical number line. All right, so... Uh, we're going to draw a vertical number line right here, and we're going to kind of think of it like a thermometer, right? Like, so zero down there is at the bottom, right? So let's, let's say 5,000 is right here, right? And let's say 6,000 is right here. So what I want to do is I want to put my, put my numbers here. So I'm just going to have to kind of guess. This is kind of like an open number line. So this might be 06,500 up here. So let me just put another midpoint in there. Let's say that's 5,500. The reason I want to do that is because I want to put these two numbers here. And I want to use these squares that we see on the screen. I want to go ahead and just put uh, some place value in there. So I'm going to put about my 5,090. I'm going to guess it's going to go right about here. 5,000 zero nine zero okay so i'm going to say that goes right about there it's just an estimate and then six thousand three hundred that's why i had to go above six thousand let's say that's going to go right around here six thousand three hundred okay so that's going to go right around yeah, there maybe a little bit lower but that's fine so let's take a look at these numbers here All right and i'll start with uh, i'll do different colors for each one take a look at that the problem is is each of my numbers here has four digits one two three four one two three four we go to the thousands place take a look at these for a one two three four five okay they're going to be off the chart they're going to be like fifty three thousand four hundred and fifty but it's not even up there it's way up there so if we just look at the place value, and that's why I lined everything up in the little squares that you see on the screen, that's way too big. So these go to the 10,000s. This whole extra digit right here makes these way too big. So A is not going to work for us, okay? Let's check B, okay? Because B, C, and D all have numbers that go to the thousands. So we can at least do those, all right? So let's try B. I'm going to have a problem right here. 5,009. If here's my 5,000, look, my 5,009 is going to be like right there, just right above the 5,000, but it's below. Remember, I need to find numbers that are in between here. So this already is too low because 9 is less than 90. And it's not going to work for us, so that's not going to work. Let's try this right here, 5,450. All right, that's going to go like right about there, and that's going to work for me, 5,450. So that works. 6,215, that's going to go right about there, less than 6,300. So that works. And then I've got 6,300. Oh, it's too much, 381. Look, right above the 380. So it's that last one that's not going to work. All right, so let's hope this last one works. 5,746. So right about there, maybe. 5,746. 6,099. So right about there. Okay, and then 6,000. Oh, barely. Look at this one. Barely going to fit. 2011 is going to go like right there, but it's less than two, uh, 215. So yeah, my answer here is going to be D.